Up in Fort Collins, the Colorado State Rams have gotten off to a ferocious start to the season. And what's really remarkable is not just how well they're playing, but how they look like a team beyond their years. Penetrates, got left down the lane, lays it up and in. Top the key to this wood, catch and shoot, three. Pick and roll, Roddy, down the lane, gets it home. We got a lot of young players, but we do have guys who've played minutes, you know, and have been in, in games and big games. Right corner, spotting up for three, absolutely. At nine and three in conference play, the Colorado State Rams are off to the second best start in program history. Impressive on its own for such a young team, even more so considering the lack of preseason work. He goes down the lane, flushes it all. We all really felt like we could take a step forward this year. Um, we really liked our group. I think when you've got the COVID stuff going on and then us having that shutdown, you know, right before the season started, really affected us because we hadn't played a game since last year. And so I think it took us a little while to kind of get our bearings straight. Without a senior on the roster, this Rams team has a basketball IQ that defies its age and a resiliency usually only seen in the most veteran of teams. There is a, a confidence and poise in a group of our age that is rare. You know, I don't know that I've seen that uh, um, that way and that's a testament to some of these guys um, for who they are. Sometimes when teams are younger, they're inexperienced, as soon as something starts to go bad, you just kind of give in and you cave in um, and our guys don't do that. It's definitely a mentality. You have to um, you have to take each, each opportunity that's given you in that moment and you have to take it for what it is. Um, you can't you can't look, you know, in five minutes in the game. You can't look back five minutes. You have to live in the moment. The Rams are serious contenders for a Mountain West title and have a shot to make the NCAA tournament for the first time since 2013. It's a lot for this young group to comprehend. The key is not making those goals their main focus. Here's the honest answer. Anyone who's involved in college basketball at our level, we think about the NCAA tournament 365 days a year. I mean, you think about it every day. I mean, you'd be lying if you don't. But we don't talk about it every day. We try to live in the moment. Um, we try not to think about those things because we know if we perform in the moment, that's going to take care of itself later down the line. It's the ability to know what the big picture is, but the way that you get there is by continuing to focus on the process. One thing is certain, these Rams are just beginning to make a statement, and they're going to be a terror in the Mountain West for years to come. Catch and shoot three straight away, good. I think the competitive nature and the togetherness that we have is uh, is pretty special, you know, and especially being so young, we're we're going through all these things together. We're still young, and we still have a lot of time left. Up next for the Rams is the Border War. They head to Laramie for a two-game set against the Cowboys on Thursday and Saturday.